What is up ladies and gentlemen, it's the fabulous Real Tuts here bringing you guys another tutorial and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to clean your computer almost to the point if you have a computer let's say that is so slow and you can barely get around these tricks that I am showing you or programs that I'm showing you will help fix it and you know I brought my laptop that was sitting in the dust for three years I just uh, the other day brought it back to life with these programs okay so this does work um, obviously I wouldn't show you something that did not work but it's gonna consist of three programs and all of the links will be in the description of download you can virus test it whatever it, you know everything's fine so first program CC cleaner okay second program TDS killer and third program defraggler Okay, defraggler. Yes, yes. Okay, so I'm gonna go through all three of these, and then, uh, uh, and then you can, uh, and then uh, also Microsoft Security Essentials. This is not one that I am going to put in the description, but it is something also I use, um, and I, I would recommend it because it does help a lot. You can you can go through weekly scans and set up everything up for that. So uh, I, I do use this as well. So yeah, I recommend getting that, but you don't need it. We're just going to be focusing on these three here. So first one, CC Cleaner. Go ahead and download that. And when you download it, you should see the cleaner here. And there's going to be all these tabs right here. And go on the windows. And you see you have all these check marks. Uh, just leave all of those check marked. But for the advanced, just check mark uh, old prefetch data, menu order, cache, and uh, window size location, un uh, user assist history, IIS log files, and custom files and folders okay so once you got all that just go ahead and click analyze it should oh and it wants me to close Chrome um, no okay so there you go it finds stuff and then you're just gonna run the cleaner press OK and it'll run through here no I don't want to close Chrome okay so once you've got all that done uh, and if you do have a bad laptop uh, for example my laptop that was destroyed it's going to take a little while. It's not going to be very quick like this. And if it doesn't take a while, that's good. That means it's cleaning out a lot of stuff. So, yeah, just, just think of it that way. So now we're going to go to registry here. Just keep all of these checked and scan for issues. Just go through all of them. It's going to scan for these issues here. And then just fix the selected issues. You can choose to uh, get backup files if you'd like. Fix selected, selected issues and issues fixed. So there you go. Next one is tools, so uninstall. So here you can uninstall a bunch of stuff that you don't need. Now you can usually do this in your control panel, but I mean this is just a little bit easier. Uh, startup here, I found this to be very helpful. And startup is programs that start when your computer turns on. So I used to have a bunch of, let me actually delete that now. I used to have a bunch of stuff that, that would pop up when I opened up my computer. Now I just took all that out, which is nice. System restore, uh, you can choose to do this, and you can uh, wipe the drivers. I don't, I don't usually do this, but I mean, you can. Uh, and then options, you don't really need to do any of this. But after you've done that, everything's pretty good. In golden, go ahead and exit that out, and now you're gonna, we can run TDS killer real quick. Now, this is good for uh, L U R N A virus, Trojan viruses, whatever. Um, yeah, this is good for that. So just start your scan. It usually doesn't take too long. And this is more for like viruses and not really cleaning your computer up very much. But but I do like it and it did help solve some viruses that I got. Okay, and no threats found. <clears throat> and then the last one's defraggler, which defrags your computer. So all you have to do is just go on this, hit analyze. It'll analyze everything for you. It doesn't take too long, but defrag does. It's gonna take a couple hours, and if you have a bad computer, even even more than that. So, yeah, probably just let that sit overnight, and uh, yeah, and everything should be good there. Uh, and then just after you're done analyzing, hit defrag. All right. So that's basically it. All links are in the description. I hope this helped you. These programs have helped me out. A ton, and yeah, I guess I will see you guys next time. Peace. Go on, leave a like, leave a like, and subscribe. Peace.